Hi everybody, this is Instructor White with a short video about the use of colors during night operations. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Here we go! Here we go! Up in the morning, way too slow! Up in the morning, way too slow! Blue is the color mostly resembling the uh, light of the moon, so it's the color of choice if you absolutely want to prevent detection by the enemy. Um, you can use it for reading, uh, navigating, looking at the map, etc, etc. However, using blue has a few downsides. One, it messes up your night vision more than the color red does. Two, if you use the color blue to look at a map, you may miss a river or a lake. And that may mean the difference between success or failure of a mission, because missing a river or lake usually means uh, making enormous detours. Thirdly, using the color blue while you are a medic uh, may prevent you from seeing somebody's veins uh, that you may need to see for uh, sticking needles in somebody, either for a drip or for medication. So, in these situations you may choose to go for the color green. So, using the color green is your second best choice if you want to avoid detection, especially in um, forested areas where uh, the blue light falling on the leaves may give off a green reflection in the night and therefore using a green light may be the best choice to avoid detection if you cannot use blue. And yes, using green also has a downside, especially when looking at a map, uh, because you may miss a forest, for example, or a field. However, um, that is not as big a mistake as missing a river or a lake can be. Then why or oh why do you so often see people using the color red? Uh, of the three colors, blue, green and red, red is the best visible um, in the night. So, if you want to avoid detection, refrain from using red if you can. However, red is the best color to use if you do not want to mess up your own night vision. Um, if you google a bit on the anatomy of the eye uh, and the, the, the way the color red is perceived, um, that means that by using red you are the quickest back to your uh, night vision, which may take up to 45 minutes until you are uh, readily used um, and your eyes have accommodated to the dark the most. Now, having said all this, especially for map reading, you may want to consider bringing a very sm uh, very low lumen light, like 10 lumens or less, which in the dark still gives off a lot of light. But if you cover it up a bit, you can use this light to read the map and make sure that you don't make any mistakes in your navigation or tactical decisions. So, to sum it up, for map reading, optimal use is a low level white light, followed by blue that mostly resembles the color of the moon, then green, and finally red that uh, messes up your night vision the least. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Here we go! Here we go! Up in the morning, way too slow! Up in the morning, way too slow!